when people fill out forms in BullGrid, it will automatically send an email to the admin address of your BullGrid site. First, I'm going to show you how to view or modify your admin address in BullGrid, and then I'm going to fill out the form and verify that the email was sent to the admin address that we viewed in the settings of our BullGrid admin dashboard. So to begin, let's go ahead and log into your BullGrid dashboard. As you see, I've already logged in. Once you're logged in, we're going to go down and click the settings link in the navigation menu. When you do that, you should be on the general settings page just like I am here. If not, you can click the general link, which would bring you to this page. And at this time, we're going to scroll down to the email address section here. And notice you can view the email address here. If you wanted to modify it at this time, you could by clicking it and actually modifying and changing the address. In my case, I'm not going to make any changes to this address, but if you did make any changes, be sure to scroll down and click the Save Changes button. Now that we know how to view or modify our admin address in BullGrid, let's go ahead and visit our website and fill out the contact form. Keep in mind your website may differ or your contact form may be different from the one you see here. It's going to be different based on your exact setup and also the type of inspiration that you chose. I'm just going to fill in the form with just test information. After filling out the form, I'm going to click the Submit button. You see I get this message saying thank you for getting in touch with us. Now I'm going to check my email to verify that I received the contact form submission. So in my case, I'm going to log into webmail and view that email. And keep in mind, the way that you check your email may differ based on your specific setup. Now that I've logged into webmail, I'm going to go to Roundcube to view my inbox. Now that I've logged in, notice that there's a form submission email here that I've received today. I'm going to open this email to verify it contains the information I submitted in the form. And you see it's the form submission information that I put in. Also notice that it went to the admin address that we viewed in the general settings of our BullGrid dashboard.